today we are going to discuss chapter 1 that is knowing our numbers. This is session 2 of chapter 1 knowing our numbers. In session 1 we have discussed importance of numbers. We know how numbers are helpful in our daily life. Comparing large numbers. We have compared the numbers having same number of digits and different number of digits. Making numbers if digits are given, we can now make the greatest and the smallest number if digits are given. We have found the predecessor of a given number. We have also found successor of a given number. We have arranged numbers in ascending and descending orders. We have learned about Indian and international system of numeration. Objectives of this session will be to compare the two systems of numeration. Today we will compare the Indian and international system of numeration. To write large numbers in words using commas, we will write the large numbers in words using Indian and international system. To know about the place value, to write the place value of a given number, to write the numbers with given conditions, to solve some practical problems based on basic mathematical operations, to convert different units of measurements from bigger to smaller and vice versa. When we compare the Indian and international system of numeration, we see that both the systems has ones, tens, hundreds, thousands and ten thousand. Lakh in Indian system of numeration is equivalent to hundred thousand in international system. Ten lakh is equivalent to million and crore is equivalent to ten million. Whenever we jump from left to right each time we multiply by ten. For example, to go from crore to 10 lakh we multiply by 10. So, 1 crore is equal to 10 10 lakhs, 1 million is equal to 10 100,000, 1 crore is equal to 10 times 10 lakhs, 1 crore is also equal to 100 times lakhs, 1 crore is equal to 1000 times 10,000 and 1 crore is equal to 10,000 times 1000. Now, we use this knowledge to fill in the blanks. When we go from million to lakh, we jump only once. So, it will be multiplied by 10 and we write 1 million is equal to 10 lakh. To go from crore to million, we jump only once. So, 1 crore is equal to 10 million. To go from crore to 1000, we jump 4 times. So, 1 crore is equal to 10,000 thousand. To go from million to 100,000, we jump only once. So, 1 million is equal to 10 hundred thousand. We put commas to separate the periods. In Indian system of numeration, first period once has three places, ones, tens and hundred. Second period thousand has two places, thousand and ten thousand. Third period lakh has two places, lakh and ten lakh. And next period crore has two places, crore and ten crore. So, in Indian system, we put commas from right as 3, 2, 2, 2. In international system of numeration, first period has 3 places, 1s, 10s and 100. Second period, 1000 has 3 places, 1000, 10,000 and 100,000. Third period, million has 3 places, million, 10 million and 100 million. So, in international system, we put commas from right as 3, 3, 3. Insert the commas and read the numbers using Indian system of numeration. The number is 1895009. 
to write this system in Indian system, we put commas from right as 3, 2, 2, 2. So, we write as 0, 4, 9, comma, 5, 0, comma, 8, 9, comma, 1, 8, 9. 1 represent the period crore. It will be read as 1 crore. 89 represent period lakh. It will be read as 89 lakh. 50 represent the period thousand. It will be read as 50,000. And 049 represent the period once. It will be read as 49. So, this number will be read as 1 crore 89 lakh 50,049. Insert the commas and read the numbers using international system of numeration. To write this number in international system, we put commas from right as 3, 3, 3. So, we write as 0, 4, 9, comma, 5, 0, 0, comma, 1, 8, 9. 1, 8, 9 represent million and it will be read as 189 million. 500 0 represent the period 1000 and will be read as 500,000 and 049 represent the period once. It will be read as 49. So, this number will be read as 189,500,049. Place value. Place value of a digit at once place is same as the digit. Place value of a digit at tens place is obtained by multiplying the digit by 10. Similarly, the place value of a digit at hundreds place, thousands place, ten thousands place, etc. is obtained by multiplying the digit by hundred, thousand, ten thousand respectively. Write the place value of each digit in 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8. Place of digit 8 is once, so its place value is 8. Place of digit 6 is tens, so its place value is 60. Place of digit 5 is hundreds, so its place value is 500. Place of digit 4 is thousand, so its place value is 4000. Place of digit 3 is 10,000, so its place value is 30,000. Place of 2 is lakhs, so its place value is 2 lakhs. Make the greatest 4 digit number using any 4 different digits with digit 7 at its 1's place. Here place of number 7 is fixed at 1's place. Now we have to choose the digits from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8 and 9. Obviously, to make the greatest number, we will choose the greatest available digit and also place the greatest digit at the highest place. The greatest number will be 9, 8, 6, 7. Make the smallest 4 digit number using any 4 different digits with digit 7 at its 1's place. Here, place of number 7 is fixed at 1's place. Now, we have to choose the other digits from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8 and 9. Obviously, to make the smallest number, we will choose the smallest available digits and place them at higher places. The smallest number will be 1, 0, 2, 7. Make the greatest 4 digit number by using any one digit twice from 3, 8, 7. Now, only 3 digits are given and we have to make a 4 digit number. To make the greatest number, we will repeat the greatest digit that is 8. The greatest number is 8, 8, 7, 3. Make the smallest 4 digit number by using any one digit twice from 3, 8, 7. Now, only 3 digits are given and we have to make a 4 digit number. To make the smallest number, we will repeat the smallest digit that is 3. 
the smallest number is 3378. The town newspaper is published every day. One copy has 12 pages. Every day 11,980 copies are printed. How many total pages are printed every day? Now each copy has 12 pages. Hence 11,900 copies will have 12 multiplied by 11,900 pages. When we multiply 11,980 with 12, we get 1,43,760. So, dear students, 1,43,760 pages are printed every day. Our next question is, the number of sheets of paper available for making notebooks is 75,000. Each sheet has 8 pages of notebook. Each notebook contains 200 pages. How many notebooks can be made from the paper available? So students, each sheet makes 8 pages. Hence, 75,000 sheets will make 8 multiply by 75,000 pages. When we multiply 75,000 with 8, we get 6 lakhs. Thus, 6 lakh pages are available for making notebooks. Now, 200 pages make 1 notebook. Hence, 6 lakh pages make 6 lakh divided by 200 notebooks. When we divide 6 lakh by 200, we get 3000. The answer is 3000 notebooks. So next question is the monthly salary of Aparna is rupees 20,975 and that of Minu is rupees 15,875. Find the difference of their salary. We will subtract the two salaries. On subtracting the two salaries we get 5100. So, the difference between their salaries is rupees 5100. Next question is find the difference between the greatest of 4 digit number and the smallest of 5 digit number. So, students as we know greatest 4 digit number is equal to 9999 and the smallest 5 digit number is equal to 1 0, 0, 0, 0. Their difference is equal to 10,000 minus 9,999 is equal to 1. So, the difference between the smallest 5 digit number and the greatest 4 digit number is 1. Conversion table of measurements. Here we can learn the different units of measurements by the statement King Harry died mother did not cry much. The units are kilometer, hectometer, decameter, meter, decimeter, centimeter and millimeter. Whenever we jump from left to right, we multiply by 10 for each step and to jump from right to left, we divide by 10 for each step. So, 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meter because we jump 3 steps from left to right. To go from kilometer to meter, 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter and 1 millimeter is equal to 1 upon 1000 meter because we jump 3 steps from right to left to go from millimeter to meter. Now we will discuss what we have learnt. We have learnt the comparison between the two systems of numeration. We have also learnt the writing large numbers in words using commas. We have learnt converting different unit of measurements from bigger to smaller and smaller to bigger. We have learnt about the place value. We have also learnt about the place value of given numbers. We have learnt about the numbers with given conditions. We have also learned about some practical problems based on the basic mathematical operations. Now this is home assignment for you. 
our question number 1 is a box contains 2 lakh medicine tablets each weighing 20 milligrams. What is the total weight of all the tablets in the box in grams and in kilograms? So, students next question for you is find the difference between the greatest and the least 5 digit number that can be written using the digits 6, 2, 7, 4, 3 each only once. Thank you. Hope you have understood. Bye-bye.